motherfucking dick, I would be sucking it. Who would suck his dick to pay your PG and E bill? Shit, I hope the water bill got the hookup like that. Anyway, how y'all doing tonight? It's a full house. Give it up for all the comics and poets and those motherfucking, uh, you can ask your bitch ass niggas. You need to ask your bitches you on the down low. I'm serious. I watched the gay porno the other day. I was jealous. Niggas sucking dick better than me. Riding and shit. I mean, you some, are you, a, are you a strong nigga if you can take some dick up there. I can't do that. I'm just gagging on dick right now. I'm just learning how to gag on it. I ain't, I ain't ready to take it up the ass yet. Or ass too little anyway. Now, now, I know some niggas out there got big dicks. But some of y'all got big dicks to nothing. I mean, how you have a dick that's so big and make a bitch hurt? I want to feel the satisfaction. I want to say, ooh, not motherfucking ow, 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 ow. Uh-uh. Who want to get fucked like that? And big bitches, give it up for the big lady. Where she at with the uh the naked uh lady? I almost got a crook in my neck looking at her ass. I went, I, I couldn't stop looking. Where she at? I want some of that ass. I need a, a cheaper son. Anyway, anybody got kids in here? Yeah. Oh, these motherfuckers get a why is 18 year old so fucking lazy? I got an 18 year old at the house and shit. Every time I go to his room, that motherfucker, he cleaned it up. He got forks and spoons and bowls and shit. I can't even eat no spaghetti and shit. Gotta wait for him. Gotta look for the forks in his room. Ain't got no silverware. Then my 20 year old, he cool, me and him got a good relationship. We got two hoes and a girlfriend. But I'm like, nigga, pick all three of them bitches. Trying to have a girlfriend and shit. I don't like that. You either gonna be one or the other. Can't play it close like that. And why would a nigga get a Cadillac? He think he gotta have hoes. Is that just how it go? Cadillac and hoes? Hell yeah. Okay, you got one? Nope. Ah, oh, shit, you can't get no hoe like that. Anyway, let me see what else I wanna talk about. Oh, I've been watching a lot of news. Y'all seen that, uh, there's a new movie coming out called The Soul Surfer. The bitch that got her arm ate by the shark. Now she's surfing like this. My new joke, but I'm getting tired of seeing white people on TV. They get shows for any motherfucking thing. I'm really thinking about becoming a serial killer. I mean, all weekend I watch serial killer shows. Ted Bundy. Who else? The Green Rich Killer. I mean, if you want to become famous, kill a couple of people. Kill a couple of people. I know serial killers running their family. Like tennis players and hustlers running ours. Excuse me, hold on, my earring came out. And I can't afford to lose my shit. This shit cost 99 cents. <laughs> shit, yeah, bitch can't afford to buy expensive shit no more. I ain't got no job. And thank God for the dollar store. Who shop at the dollar store? Yeah. Me! And my son got hella toys. Woo, that's so, I got so many toys from that motherfucker stuff. It's not a problem. I was hoping they was gonna legalize weed and shit. And I was just imagining that shit being in a dollar store. I go on that motherfucker with $20, be shopping. First, I get my weed first. $10 worth of weed. And then, that shit ain't good, I'm taking it back with my motherfucking receipt. Like, nigga, I smoked one blunt, I ain't even high yet. I want my money back. But they ain't legalized that shit, so now I'm still buying it from these on the corner. But all my partners got cannabis cars. Who got cannabis cars in here? Everybody broke. I don't even know who to borrow money from no more. I used to call my grandma like every day. But now that owe that bitch a hundred dollars, I can't even call her. She mad as shit. I'm just unemployed. And I'm trying to help my daddy get rid of this DUI he got on his Uber round. How the fuck you get a DUI on the Uber round? He got one. He got one. He mad at me and shit about it. Talk about I should have let him drive the car. Nigga, please. You ain't know who were there, and let me tell you, that nigga rode it. It ain't got no wheels on it now. He didn't put shopping carts wheel on the motherfucker. He a rider, he a rider. My mama is too. She from Oakland, the real Oakland, when it was East 14. Not the Espanol Oakland y'all live in now. What's that called? 
International Boulevard, East 14th, the real open. Not only that, let me see who I can talk about this artist. Everybody standing up looking like roaches just moving around and shit. Turn the lights on over there and stop moving. <laughs> shit, where the bald head niggas at? Who no nigga, no nigga. I need to see some bald head niggas because all these niggas with these dreads and shit and getting on. Oh, ooh, shit. Oh, that's your man, though. But he got one of those pointy heads. Well, that's your man, though. That's your man, though. But I like bald head niggas. They just so sexy. When they down in your pussy, like the lip to lip contact and the ear rubbing. You know, huh? Because niggas with dreads, I can't have that much hair on my pussy. I just, I just don't like that. It be like itching and shit. But uh, I'm going to go now. I'm going to love you, Jacqueline Williams. But before I go, if you think I'm hella funny, I am having a comedy show on uh, April the 30th. I'm a tourist. So I would like y'all to come out and celebrate with me in the Aries. And uh, you guys have a nice, safe night. And don't forget to vote for Obama or your motherfucker to be in slavery. For real, though. Good night.